What is happening guys? Welcome. I am out exploring today. I've got too much to do at home that I really can't spend uh, an overnighter uh, camping. So I figured, you know what, let's just go out and explore and have some fun. I'm kind of flying by the seat of my pants. Uh, I quickly just looked up some places, some areas. I'm like, you know what, I'm just going to go and have some fun and see what I see. I'm going to get my hiking boots on and then uh, I'm at my first stop. Let me see what they're called. <sighs> so I believe I'm at the Ambrosia Mill. And then we are going to head to the Purple Pansy Mill mine. So I made it to the top of this structure. I imagine that's where they brought the ore, ground it down, whatever, filtered it through and dumped it. You can see a bunch of rock piles over there and over there. And it looks like there's some, some structures there. Someone's camping down there. And I see a few other things off in the distance for sure. I'm gonna go, let's go wander around and check them out real quick. Can't complain about the view out here though. Take a look. Here, here's the bottom. Oh, that's stuck. There's some wood in there. Cool. All right, I saw something over here in this direction I want to check out. Oh, it looks like there's a little concrete something stuck right here. So you can tell there was a structure right here. Okay. I wonder what, whatever, whatever building was here that housed whatever. Ugh. I saw this from when I was standing up on that big old thing. I wonder what they use this for. Maybe it was a filter after they break down the ore and the rocks, they're just filtering it out. Cool. This is more just like a pit stop for me uh, before I actually head over to the mine and explore really out there. I figured, you know, since this is literally on the road that I have to get to, to the mine, I'll make a pit stop here. So I'm just kind of doing like a big old circle just to see what there is. And there's this structure with my concrete slab right here. Too bad this isn't like, uh, what do you call it? Swansea, the first one I went to that had all the plaques and told you what everything used to be. All right, that was cool. I'm, I'm back at the truck. I'm gonna, actually gonna air down now. So I wasn't planning on seeing much at this spot, but I decided to stop here because this is pretty much the start of the trailhead. And so I'm gonna air down and I'm gonna head to the Purple Pansy Mine which should have more to see, explore, and check out. So let's air down and get there.
that wasn't actually that far from the mill and the road wasn't even that bad i don't i probably shouldn't have aired down but i am going to go exploring a little bit So the road does continue that way, which I am going to take because um, from what I read is you got to drive around and look for the, the mines, the holes. There's this fence right here, which has this gated off. I wonder why. That was the first structure I saw, was this sucker right here. Cool. All right, I do want to check those out, but before I go, I think there's a hole or something right here. And across from that man. I'm gonna hold on to this. It's a sturdy, yeah. So there's a hole right there. I would love to venture that way, but eh, a little too dangerous. Concrete cylinder. I'm guessing those just house the water. All right. Let's continue on. Oh, I think. Let's continue on down and see what we can find. What else we can find. Okay. So no joke. I was right over there. I got on the road and I literally saw this fence. And then I saw something over here and I was like, all right, I'm just gonna stop. Like literally the road is right here. It's a fire ring right here, cool. Oh. So can I tell you guys, I 100% remember this morning, grab a trash bag. The only problem is when I was putting everything in my car this morning, I forgot to grab the trash bag. It is literally sitting on my counter. So I'm just curious if there's a hole. There is, maybe. There's something right here. Or there's not. <clears throat> okay, there's nothing over here. I'm gonna come this way. Let's come over here. No. Nope. Okay, there's an opening in this fence right here, so we're just gonna come through here. I wonder if this is just a big old rock pile. Okay. See no holes. So this is it. This is a big old rock pile. That's all it's fenced off. So I'm gonna take this road and see if it leads to any holes, mines, and then I'll end up on the other side of this like hill and check uh, anything out over there.
so I saw on the map the trail ends. I'm gonna head to the end of the trail to see if I can find anything. But before, like, I'm almost there, but like this big hole showed up. So this big old hole right here. I imagine, oh man, because it kind of leads down there. Man, that would actually be kind of cool to camp here. Yeah, look at that. It ends right there. We are going to venture down there. I just want to come to this edge real quick. So, should I end the trail, come back here? Or should I go down there and then end the trail? That's what I'm thinking right now. We're debating. Oh yeah, there was definitely mining here. We're going to have to go down there. But first, I'm gonna finish the trail. I'm gonna get to the end of the road, see what's out there, and then start backtracking my way. So I guess I hit the end of the road. There's a fence right here. So let's start trucking it back and check out that big old hole, which I imagine I'm gonna make a future camping spot. All right, so I lied. I parked it and there's this very faded trail that goes this way. And my curiosity is bugging me. Will it lead to anything? So I'm just gonna walk a little bit. So the trail all but disappeared, but I see something off in the distance. And so I'm like, screw it, I'm, we're gonna hike it out. Cause I saw some stuff. And I'm like, there might be something. So let me get there and see if there is anything. So the one thing that caught my eye that prompted me to come out that I thought might've been like a, a structure or like a, the foundation of something was this this rock because it's uh has white and it's brighter than all the other rocks i was like oh that might be something it's nothing but there's definitely some man-made thing over there and there's a trail right there too huh So I'm just wandering in the desert and I just stumbled upon a trail. I am gonna go, so I am gonna go the opposite way I'm walking right now. I just wanna see and th th these roads don't get traveled a lot. Okay. I can tell it keeps going that way. But I'm just getting further and further away from my car. So I'm just gonna start heading back to the vehicle. Kind of. I'm headed in the direction where I, I you could see some definitely man-made things. So, I mean, it's not man-made, but you can tell they were Digging, looking, seeing if there's anything there to mine, extract. Let's wander up here and see if they were just digging on the side or if they were digging low, going down. Ah. Eh, no. Looks like they were just going into the side of the mountain to see if there was anything. So 
So I came to the bottom of that big old hole. See, I just drove down from up there and kind of circled away right here. So you can take a look these rock piles there's some over there some up there you can see we drove past a bunch they're all right there you can tell uh plants are starting to overtake and hide them a little bit but you can totally tell that all these were at least from that hole or from like maybe other holes that they were trying to like dig and find whatever they're looking for. Found another hole. It's just been driving all over the place. Dang. There you go. I can see. I don't know if that's like a bottom or that's like just like it just it goes down that way and then comes back down that way. Thought I saw some structures, but they were just rocks. Okay. Looks like there's something up there too. All right, let's go check that out. Says, posted, no trespassing. Oh man. Damn. Let me come on this side. See, I'm wearing my hugging boots, so I'm not slipping and sliding everywhere. No. There we go. Okay. Yeah, it just descends down into darkness. Crazy. All right, I can see my trail leads up to some concrete structure. I don't think there's gonna be anything else up here, but I do wanna come right up here. See if this is the top. See if there's a view. Well, there obviously is gonna be a view, but check it out. So I reached the top. There's some holes there. It leads to nothing, just small holes. But I'm on the other side of like the mountain. So you can see we started right here. If you see that structure, that's the building we first went to. And then I drove all the way down there, explored down there a little bit, which wasn't a lot. And then I, I came on this side and that's when we found those holes. Now I'm gonna go further up that way. Two big old concrete cylinders. Imagine that's for water. So my guess is these suckers would feed the cylinders that are down there for whatever they freaking needed. Okay, I know what I'm gonna do. I am gonna head up there and we're gonna do a 360 of the views. 
and one day I'll actually have a tri or a, a tripod, a freaking drone, so I can just put it up in the air. All right, I found a rock comfortable enough uh, that I can sit on and enjoy my food. I should say, so I can enjoy my food and uh, the view. So this is a nice little day trip. You know, I was expecting to see more because what I read implied that there was more out here. But either way, awesome to get out. Saw some good camping areas. And the view, man, Whew, the view. I know the camera never does it justice, but dang. And you know what's really cool? Here, let me take the camera and point it out. It's something I love. Um, when there are clouds everywhere, you can see like the shadow, like you know, over there on the mountain. And it just, it, it creates, I don't know, more, what's the word I'm looking for? It just makes it, it makes it more interesting. <clears throat> All right, I'm heading out of here. I got to unfortunately head back to civilization. It was a good day trip. You know, I thought I was going to see more, but I didn't, whatever. All right. So just like normal guys, I appreciate you. Remember, it is only impossible until it no longer is. And hopefully I'll see you next time. Take care.